Welcome to class 4 mathematics. Long and short part 1. Topic units of length. I think all of you have this in your pencil box. This is a scale. What is it used for? Scale is used to draw line. Have you observed numbers written on it from 0 to 15? If you carefully look at it, you can see big lines showing 0 to 15. This is a scale of length 15 centimeters. The length from 0 to 1 can be called as 1 centimeter. 1 to 2 again 1 centimeter. Like that it goes on. Did you see small lines in between each centimeter? They are the millimeters. Each centimeter consists of 10 millimeters. That is 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeters. Observe these coins. Imagine the thickness of a coin. How will you measure it? It can be measured in millimeter. Observe these pictures. Can you find the length of these things using a scale? Yes, you can find the length of these things using a centimeter scale. The unit to measure these things is centimeter. You can see two children like you on the screen. How can you measure their heights? Which unit is used to measure their heights? Yes, we can use centimeter to measure their heights. See these pictures. Can you measure the length of these things using scale? It's difficult. So, we use another unit for it, which is meter. 100 centimeter is equal to 1 meter. Have you traveled long distances in plane or train? You can see a map showing distance from Trivandrum to New Delhi. Imagine the distance. How can you measure the distance? Distance can be measured in kilometers. 1000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer. We learned that there are different units of length. Millimeter, centimeter, meter and kilometer. Millimeter can be represented by mm. Centimeter can be written as cm. Meter written as M. Kilometer KM. 10 millimeters is equal to 1 centimeter. 100 centimeters is equal to 1 meter. 1000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer. Now it's question time. Choose the better unit to measure the following. First question, your height. Second question, distance from New Delhi to Mumbai. Third question, thickness of a 5 rupee coin. Fourth question, length of your diary. And the last question, length of a 100 rupee note. I hope you got an idea about different units of length. Thank you. See you again.